exam. And then I went to my psychology class. I took my exam. I got out at like 1.30. And Kayla and some of our other friends were in the dining hall eating lunch. So I went over there. And then I just came back over here, took a shower, kind of chilled out for a little bit. But now I need to go to a study room, and after this, I'm going to go to a study room and study for my exam tomorrow. I have a history exam tomorrow, and it's an in-class essay. So I have to kind of really be educated on, like, some of the more recent topics, just so that when he gives us the prompt tomorrow, I'm not freaking out and, like, not knowing what to write. Pretty sure it has to be six paragraphs. Which is why I got the green book, and then I just need a pencil. I'm supposed to walk in there, he gives us the prompt, and I'm supposed to write six paragraphs, like... And he's like... You don't have to use, like, direct quotes, but you have to, like, use, like, events that happen for evidence, like, just being, like... Because of, like, this event, like... Or, like, you know what I'm saying? Which is scary. me. Like, I don't know. Kayla just went to... I was just with Kayla right now. Um... Well, she just got back from Phil's, and then she went straight to a study room, because she's taking... Kayla's super lucky, because, like, she only had one in-class final. The rest of them are online. So, technically, she was done. She had an in-class final yesterday, and she could go home. She could have gone home yesterday, but she's kind of just waiting, because, like, everyone else is still here. And she knows that I have to be here till next Monday, so she was like, I'm not going to leave you for that long alone. Um, yeah, she actually, I think she only has one more final, and it's still online, and I think she went into the study room to go take it. Because she was going to take it at home, but somebody told her it was kind of hard, So, and she's been here, so she's here, so might as well just take it in the study room and not be distracted. But I'm going to go join her in the study room after I'm done with this. So that I can try and study for my exam tomorrow. And then after I take my exam tomorrow, I'm not going to freak out too much about my physio one. Because I feel like the more that I freak out, the worse I do. Oh, he's hiding. I'm trying to like derm clean my face, but like nothing's really coming off. Like, I don't know if I really don't have a lot of baby hairs right now, but I haven't done this in a while, so I thought I would. He's really not. Hmm. Yeah, nothing really coming off my face. So I'm just gonna pluck my eyebrows a little bit, and then I'll do a little bit of makeup and go study. Which I'm just like, not that I'm procrastinating because I have a lot of time and I don't think it's going to take me very long. I just, I don't know. I'm scared. We have literally two hours for the, the exam tomorrow. I'm not trying to be in that class for two hours. Like, I want to be done. In, to write six paragraphs, I literally think I can do in less than an hour if I'm confident about, like, what I'm writing, you know? Because then I'm like, when I'm writing essays, I can do them fast as long as I'm, like, educated on the topics. So, I don't know. I feel like I want to dump this out. Like, you know how I broke this one? I literally broke this one, too. Like, but this one's more pigmented. Like, I want to dump this one in this one so that it's not falling everywhere as much. But also, it's all over my floor. It's, like, no helping me. I also, like, can't really show you guys me, like, plucking my eyebrows because, like, uh-oh. One second. I'll pick it up right now.
You know, also got me gummy and shit. She went to Target and she asked me if I wanted anything. I was like, can you just get me gum? It's perfect. Okay, I'm plugging my eyebrows. My mirror's right here, so. That's the best you guys are going to be able to see, I think. Like. I look scary. Sorry. I'm locked in, bro. I'm like missing every hair. <laughs> 